Hello everybody, today in front of me I have Vivo Y16 and in this video we would like to demonstrate how you can set up and configure the parental controls feature on this device. So the first step that you need to take is to launch settings, then enter the Google category. In here make sure that uh, no accounts are currently linked to your device, if there are any just uh, remove them which you can do by tapping over here, going for the manage accounts on this device option. And in here, just remove the account like so. Once there are no associated accounts left, uh, at the Google category, tap on the parental controls section, tap on the get started button, choose the child or teenager option, next. Already, so as you can see, this little um, process has lagged a little, so it will be easier for me to relaunch it. Yep, seems like relaunch it entirely. Whatever, I'll open up settings, go for the Google category, then parental controls. Get started, child or teenager, next. Now we will wait for a little bit. At this step, we will need to add uh, the child's Google account. So let me do exactly that. I will enter the credentials, thus email and password of the screen real quick. So once you have uh, entered the email and password for the child's account, oh, and before I proceed, it is uh, important to mention that uh, obviously the child uh, has to not know the password to this account since uh, if it does, uh, I mean, him or her will be able to bypass it pretty easily. So in here, tap on the I agree button, then accept. Then choose the account that we have uh, literally just logged into. At the next step, you gotta enter the parent's Google account credentials, thus email and password, which I will also do off the screen real quick. In here, you can read um, a few details about the supervision, so what this feature is capable of. Once you have read everything that you're interested to, just scroll the page all the way down. By the way, you will not have as many devices as I do, so no worries. So basically, scroll the page all the way down, and in order to finalize the linking, the account linking process, enter the uh, password to the child's Google account once again. Then tap on the blue agree button. After that, tap on the allow. Wait until child and parent accounts will be linked. Then click on next. Here you can uh, well, manage child's applications that will be turned on or turned off. You can skip the step as for now since you will still be able to set those app limits later. So if you would like to finish the uh, set up procedure SAP, just skip the step as I just did. Next, you can also uh, check the filters and content restrictions and change them if you want to. Mm. In here, basically, uh, if the cell device in bold font uh, is the one that you will use for supervision, you can tap on the blue install family link button. If it is not, just skip and manually download the family link application from the Play Store to your uh, parents smartphone but in my case it is correct so I'll tap on install family link in here on my Nokia device you will be able to see that the uh, inst family link app has been automatically mm, downloaded and now it will finalize this process as well as get installed 
So on the child's end, we are all set. Now we will need to make a few shenanigans uh, on the supervisor's smartphone, which is Nokia in my case. So once the Family Link app is downloaded and installed, you've got a launch it. Make sure to log into this app with the parents account that you have uh, pointed out while setting up uh, the uh, parental controls on the child's end. So in here we will wait until the app gets loaded. So make sure to uh, choose the supervisor's account. And in here you will be able to start uh, configuring the Parental controls, as you can see, the phone is displayed right over here. Hmm. You can set the data limits, the downtime, the app limits. So manage those app limits and manage the app activity in general. Content restrictions, configure them, manage account settings and manage devices as well already so that would be it for this video guys thank you so much for watching thank you so much for your attention and bye bye